Well, what am I doing here today? Okay, today, let's go look down here at the camera. Hello, camera. And my little buddy down here. Hi. No. Anyhow, today I was going to show you some stuff I've had hanging around the garage. Um, this is our sort of a tragic story on this one. This was an instrument panel from a uh, 1960 vehicle. Now, I don't know which one it went to, but the guy I got it from, he had it for over 20 years, and it never had a crack or a break or anything in it at all. It was in perfect shape. It comes to me, and look at this. Now, the glass down here was cracked, and I said, oh, well, I guess I'll have to get a new piece of glass. Unfortunately, I can't get another piece of glass for it because it's all stenciled on the glass, which says gasoline. So all I could do was put it back together the way it was. So kind of, and that was because some new mail guy stuffed the box inside of a mail or mailbox down below and was not very nice about it. He just mashed that thing in. In fact, there's a slight bend over here. This isn't supposed to be here either. And this is pretty solid stuff, so he had to really work at jamming it in there. So, anyhow, but that's one little item I have here. And uh, this is a, a new hood ornament I was going to put on my truck. And the little eyeballs are actually lit up, or light up. But the problem with this one was I have to wire it back up because the wire busted down below where you're supposed to hook it to the battery. But I'll get around to that one too. And then the motometers you've seen already. I've got that one. Most of them for, from, from Fords though, um, except for the big one. Now this big one was actually from a, a, a Pierce Arrow. And uh, well, 1920s. That's why it's so big compared to everything else. And if you look at the other ones, uh, yeah, it's uh, a wee bit bigger. And this was from a Ford. But the thing with this is the temperature part of it, the globe is missing on the inside. It is a for a Ford, though. So probably around 30 somewhere, maybe, I don't know, 40, but it's in pretty good shape for its age. And then I have another hood ornament. And what is that one from? I don't really know. I know the emblem is for a Mercury. So it looks like a Ford emblem, but it, it could possibly be just for a Mercury of some kind. I don't know which one. Uh, although the chrome is in pretty good shape. You made a guess. I don't know. Now this one came to me. It was really rusted up. I actually got it to shine again. Um, but it's still got some pits and stuff in it. But as you can see, it is a huge ornament. Car. I have no idea what this goes to either. I know if you turn on the back, I know it says Ford, but that's all I know. I don't know what else, it, what it came off of. Anybody knows, let me know. Finally, I have this. What is it? It's a gas guard, gas cap. It says it needs no keys or anything. I have no idea when this came out. I can't really tell. I don't really know. It has really no other date or anything like that on it. But it'll keep you from keep someone from siphoning gas out of your tank up to a certain point because it only go, it goes that far in. And um, but this stun screws and pops open, and you put that in your your gas your gas tank. So I guess. I really don't know when that one was either, what year that was. I have no idea. Anybody know? Let me know. I haven't, I haven't got a clue what year it was. But I'm checking. It's got patent numbers on it. I guess I could check the patent office on it, but 
Well, I see the newest date on it is March of 1943. I have no idea if it's that old. Maybe it's at least, I know it's at least that old, 1943. I've got it in the box and everything. So I guess if it's a collector's item, it's there. Uh, oh, I know. One more thing. In December, I'm going to be 66 years old, so in honor of my birthday, I bought a Route 66 sign <laughs> online. I told George, uh, the Shade Dream uh, Fix-It guy, I was going to go ahead and, and, and get a, a Route 66 sign for my birthday for in December. So I actually got one. It just came in the mail just just yesterday. So there we are. Anyhow. So yeah, if anybody knows about this other some of this other stuff, or what you know, I, like I said, this is somewhere from the '60s. I have no idea where. And this one, I really don't know when that one was. I have no idea. Really no way to date these unless someone had the car that went on. I don't know. Anyhow, that's it for now. Have fun.